that is so fetch. Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Kaya and today we are going to be checking out a brand new single from the band, An Abstract Illusion. Now, this band is releasing their sophomore record on September 9th of this year and we're going to be checking out their second single, which is In the Heavens Above, You Will Become a Monster, which was just released on August 15th. So I'm pretty excited. If you don't know An Abstract Illusion, they are a progressive atmospheric death black metal trio. And uh, Bestie, the album cover for this album, okay, their album is going to be called Woe. I think that's how you pronounce it. And this literally, like the album cover looks like a painting, like a very expensive painting. So I'm very excited to listen to this. So yeah, that's what we got planned. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, please feel free to do so. Uh, come and join our metal journey. We are so close to 10,000 subscribers and I'm super, super stoked. Okay, because once we get to 10,000 subscribers, Bessie, we start a Twitch, okay? Um, make sure you like and share this video. Let me know what you think about an abstract illusion and all of the band information, links, and bio will be down below in the description um, so y'all can check out more of this band, learn more about them if you really like their stuff, and also um, pre-order their album. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. there's already so much going on there's like a little bit of synth it almost sounds like a combination of like electronic drums mixed with real drums and I really like it oh, there's like a little bit of synth in there too and also his like deeper gutturals the way it was like layered in the beginning ooh, ooh, it was buttery it was real buttery <laughs> where everything kind of dropped off they had a little bit of like radio crackle sound 
But they did these, like, before that, they did these very beautiful, like, I don't know, guitar notes that just, like, kind of rang out, I think. And it was, like, mm, I could, like, see it live just being, like, this experience. Like, I really want to experience this song live and if they're still a trio honey they're filling up a lot of space okay dying fetus was a trio for quite a bit of time and they didn't sound like it was just the three of them but there's also like the keys to it's doing something here that's a really nice like melody it's very catchy <laughs> drop of that. reverb would be so nice oh, mm. oh and I love the freaking synth it's just so like it's reminding me of like 80s kind of like stranger things I'm getting old path vibes I'm getting inspirational in my feel vibes oh and I feel like it's a total experience like we're going through like a thousand chapters and also their transitions are pretty clean. They're pretty dang clean. it live. I'm just imagining it live. 
I really want to, to hear this live because this section, this like fill, I feel like we're about to go into a different chapter, like a different part of the song. Uh, it sounds amazing, especially, I'm pretty sure it's his guitar that's doing the bum 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 bum, like the little twang thing. I, my ear wants to hear strings. I feel like just a bum bum, like the mmm, to have the strings, maybe something a little higher too. I'm enjoying it so far. right here really low in the mix though panned all the way this way oh it's like pocketed right here is his lower octave oh man that's a meat sandwich holy cow oh my gosh and the pause right before the section because they they kind of linger and just like have this sort of like uh pause like atmospheric pause before they slam you in the face with this section oh Oh, it makes you almost think that they're going to go into some, like, sort of mellow thing, and then they pick it back up. giving me Opeth vibes. This second, third chapter, I'm guessing, is what this is, is absolutely beautiful. And it's the acoustic guitar. I mean, y'all already know. If you've been watching me for a while, you know the acoustic guitar is my weakness, okay? And right before the section, I could hear it. 
hear them strumming away on that thing and now she's got she's got the front row seat so um we might shed a couple tears the drummer is very talented he was doing some stuff where he was like going to do <laughs> look okay I love drums. I don't know how to play them, but he was like going to do, I don't know, he was doing something like this and then double bass in it and then doing this. He was just having a grand old time doing his thing. Sounded very, very good. Oh. in this section too the first time around when they did this sort of ambiance thing he had the melody -na -na, something like that and then the second time around he's really only doing like single notes so he's not giving you the melody oh I hope the third time I hope they go around the third time and he does it oh that would be so cool song like a beautiful song and I wasn't expecting the woman's voice because it's like three dudes in the band and I love that the end of every time she sings they they re like reverb her voice it's not a reverb it's a vocal effect where it like stagnates those last words there's a word for it don't judge me <laughs> But I like it, and it's in time with the beat. And it's almost like she's got this, it's either like doubled to sound like that, or she has some sort of effect to give it this sort of like roomier, kind of grittier vibe. And there's like 
nice, very low, very subtle male harmonies going right under her in this section that are just divine. <laughs> Definitely was not expecting to cry today. Oh my gosh, I'm not prepared. Not prepared. Was not prepared. Was not emotionally prepared. Oh my gosh. What just happened? What an experience. Oh, I feel like I did after I listened to Blackwater Park. Okay, still like is coming bestie it's just i had to take some time to emotionally heal and prepare and this song just got me all in my feels what a beautiful track i can definitely see the um atmospheric ambient sort of metal side of it. It's very opeth. It's very beautiful. It's got some amazing, just beautiful layers and vocals and the section leading like out of the woman, like she has this high note and then he just comes in with this ugh, beautiful guttural. Man, that was inspiring. That was beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I really, really enjoyed that. I felt like I was like, I don't know, an adventure movie. <laughs> yeah, I don't have the official lyrics for this song, but I have notes on what they are about. Um, and an abstract illusion says the overarching concept for the album is groups, people, or institutions oppressing others they perceive as beneath them. Removal of rights to bodily autonomy, child abuse, honor-based violence. The POV is taking on the role of the oppressor in the lyrics to slaves. Song title is another hint. Ooh. Very interesting. Oh. So that was today's video on an abstract illusion. What did you think? What did you think of the song? 
um, in the heavens above, you will become a monster. I'm very excited to um, listen to their other singles and really this album. Uh, I'm looking at the song track list right now and Bestie, it's looking pretty, pretty nice. Um, I am very interested to know more about this band. If you know anything about an abstract illusion, please let me know. Um, because I really like what we heard. It was very beautiful, inspiring. It get, got me in my feels. There were really good gutturals, really great layers. There was keys. There were freaking, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it gave me old pet vibes. I'm in my feels. I feel inspired. And I really, really like it. So let me know your thoughts. And, um, if you want to know more about this band, please go check out all the links down in the description. I will have everything from their social media to where you can pre-order the album, find out more information about the band, and you can also read their band bio to get a little bit more information. So definitely do that. And um, yeah, thank you so much to Willow Tip Records for providing me the information. So um Super exciting things are happening on this channel. You're going to start seeing some new videos from me as I'm um, starting to work with more labels and get some more um, PR stuff. So do stay tuned for more. We have some big things going on behind the scenes here. Um, so stay tuned. I love you very much. Thank you so much for uh, spending time with me, for watching this video. Um, I'm very excited about this band. Like, I really want to listen to this more of this record. Ah! Okay, uh, enjoy the rest of your evening, your morning, your noon, your nights. Um, not, not really in that order, but in that order. <laughs> um, and I'll see you very, very soon. Make sure you subscribe also. We're so close to 10k, bestie, okay? I love you. Goodbye.